How's it going everyone? Today we have a brand new FIFA video. We have rewards again. This time we placed Elite 1. Yep, this is the first time in this channel that I have placed Elite 1 and I can bring Elite 1 rewards to you guys and I'm super excited for it because we've got two Premier Team of the Week packs and two Jumbo Rare Players packs along with 125,000 coins. That really doesn't make a difference for the purpose of the videos today. But those four packs are insane. Honestly, the Jumbo Rare Players packs are pretty much crap every time you open it but those two Premium Team of the Week packs we basically got six informs and I've never been able to show those uh, rewards to you since I started the channel. I've never hit Elite 1. And not only that, as you can see on screen, we actually placed 79th in the region. <laughs> I know that doesn't mean much, uh, it's just the regional top 100, it's not even the world top 100 obviously because I just had 34 wins, but this is probably uh, one of my best finishes and I'm really proud of it. 79 in the American region, that's pretty good, I'll, t I'll take it for now. And the team of the week, this week is pretty intense as well, I mean it's not as good as it was compared to last, but it's still one of the higher end uh, team of the weeks that we've had in FIFA 17. We've got quite a few walkout possibilities, we've got Socrates here, who will most likely be a walkout, we've got Carrasco on left mid, and then we've got Isco. 90 rated Isco. Isco has been uh, in form a few times at this point. And then we also have Di Maria and finally Kevin De Bruyne who we're definitely aiming for in this team of the week to pack. He's the highest rated one and if we pack that it'll just be absolutely insane. We packed a Kevin De Bruyne last week. It was in the monthly. So we packed the 90 rated red Kevin De Bruyne and he's playing in our team right now. So if we pro probably packed this Kevin De Bruyne we're probably just gonna sell him. But that's still a whole lot of coins right? And then on the bench we've got Leno as a keeper and you know what if we pack this Leno I might just give him a shot over Neuer for a few games see how he pans out because he's an informed one and his 86 version the regular Leno is a pretty good card I've played with him a few games and he was pretty good but apart from that another player that I'm really excited about getting is the informed Shakiri. the reason is he's 5'7 he's a short player so he has great balance and on top of that I just checked his physical he has 81 strength right now we're playing a uh, Walcott as a right forward but if we get this Shakiri, we'll probably uh Swap Walcott with Shakiri and give him a few games because Shakiri does have 4 star weak foot and 4 star skill moves. Walcott doesn't have 4 star skill moves. I don't think he even has 4 star weak foot to be fair. But yeah, those are a few of the cards that I'm excited for in this team of the week. If we don't get any of the walkouts but we do pack Shakiri, I'll still be way happy with the results. Well, let's see what really happens. I also did some SBC, so as you can see, we have some uh, extra packs. We have the gold players pack and the premium gold players pack. I'm definitely gonna open these two first and then we're gonna get into the rewards. But yeah, yeah, let's just get started with the gold players pack. We're gonna leave the horse set out of it for now. I don't want to exhaust our luck that we get from the horse set on these stupid packs. We're just gonna leave it out till we hit the Jumbo Air players packs and the team of the week packs. All right, let's hit it. Let's open our first pack. Come on, who is it? Who is it? It's not a walkout. Ah, oh, it's a tiny chest flare, man. Is it Balotelli? No, it's not Balotelli. It's Quagmire. Man, you know, it is what it is. We definitely weren't expecting anything good from this pack, so it's hard to uh, sound disappointed. All right, here comes the other SBC pack right here. This one's got three rare players out of the 12 goals, so let's see what happens. Possibility to pack someone better, but it's not a walkout. It's a tiny freaking ass flare again. Oh my gosh. Who is it? Uh, it's Burger Installer. Something, something along those lines. But anyway, he's definitely not gonna start in our team, so what's the point? Let's just put everyone in the club again. Let's discard the rest. And now we're gonna get into the better ones. And now before we get to open these packs, it's time to bring the horse head into play. And hopefully he grants that extreme luck that he's given us over the past weeks. But yeah, let's get dressed. There we go. We're ready right now. Super excited to open these packs. Let's start off with the Jumbo Air Players pack. Hopefully we get a walkout from these two. It's not a walkout. Please be an inform. Oh, it's a legit flare. Oh, it's green. You know what? It's not bad. An 85 is not bad. Maybe they'll sneak in a Kante in there. I'm trying to pack that 83 Kante for a while now. Nah. Ooh, Insigne. Wow, that's, that's a good one. That's a good pack right there. And Mane. Oh my gosh. Those guys actually uh, sell for something, you know? Hey, all in all, in all a great pack, I won't lie. So first pack, not bad at all. I might actually go back and sell uh, Kane and uh, Mane. I'll probably keep Insigne because like I said, I'm uh, planning on building a Calcio squad at some point just to try them out. But uh, yeah, other than that, it wasn't, it wasn't a bad pack at all. So let's hope the second pack is a little bit better than the first one. You can only hope and pray. It's not a walkout. Please be an informed. It was a massive flare again. 
Ah, oh, it's Hummels, isn't it? Yep, it's Hummels. Again, not not the worst player at all. An 87 from a Jumbo Air Player Spec is pretty good. I haven't been getting good players in Jumbo Air Player Spec for a long, long time. So I, I, I will take these, you know, not, not bad. Anyhow, now we're into the most interesting ones. We get six team of the weeks in these two packs. With my luck, we'll probably get the same three players twice. But yeah, let's not jinx it. Let's just open it and hope we get a walkout. Oh, it's a walkout! It's a walkout! The first pack's a walkout! Holy fuck, the first day of the walkout! What is this? Oh, it's Socrates! Nice! Yes! Fuck yeah! Wow! First pack and it's a walkout and we get one of the better ones! Let's see who else. Zapata is actually really good. Seri is really good too. These players are all good. Holy fuck, that was a great pack. Let's see how much he sells for. Awesome. Uh, JK, he doesn't sell for much, but he actually has some good stats. He seems like a well-rounded uh, center mid, you know? Anyhow, I'm just gonna save all of them. I'm gonna save Socrates too, because I do play Neuer, Boateng, and Alaba in defense. And on the other side, I play uh, Ogbonna and Coleman. But with Socrates here, I'm gonna just make it all Bundesliga defense and see how that works. I don't know if it will work properly with the Prem team I have currently, because Ogbonna and Coleman links up with uh, Kante and Pogba. But I'm gonna just give it a shot, because Socrates Socrates is worth it, you know, he's, he's such a great defender, 82 pace with 90 enough physical and defense, so it's definitely worth the shot, I'm definitely gonna try him in this weekend league and see how that goes. But yeah, first one was a walkout, the power of the horse shows the way. If you guys are enjoying the video so far, if you guys enjoyed that awesome pack that we just pulled with Socrates in it, make sure to hit that subscribe button if you're new to the channel. It lets me know that I'm creating good content for you guys and that you guys are enjoying it. And it is going to help us to grow this channel into something amazing. So do consider hitting the subscribe button if you're new to the channel. It goes a long way towards helping me. Thank you guys. Well, now it's time for the second one. Let's hope we pack another walkout. That would just make my day. If we pack a De Bruyne or a Di Maria now, I would just absolutely lose it, man. Oh, it's not a walkout. Oh, it's Prom. You know what? He might actually sell for something. He has some really good stats. Please sneak in a Shakiri there. <laughs> that would be really too much to ask, but... Ah. Ah, uh, let's see how much promise is worth. That actually wasn't a bad pack at all. Oh, wow! He goes for like 60k. Nice! I haven't actually checked how much uh, Zapata goes for. Let me just uh, check that real quick too. Uh, Zapata's discard price. But yeah, so it's like 70, 80 grand from this pack and then we got Socrates on the other one. I haven't even checked how much Socrates goes for. He probably goes for like 200k. But I didn't really check because I, like I said, I want to play Socrates in my club. I don't really plan on selling him. Even if I don't put him in in the current squad, I will definitely morph him into some uh, some hybrid squad we cook up later on so yeah definitely planning on keeping socrates but yeah guys that's it for the video today i hope you guys enjoyed it i just wanted to show you quickly how much that socrates is going for he's going for like 130 grand which again is a pretty good value if i do intend to sell him later on also something i wanted to share with you guys before i let you go today is uh this weekend unfortunately i'll be gone i'm going to coachella <laughs> Yep, I'm going to Coachella, the huge ass concert over the entire uh, weekend. And I probably won't be able to play foot champs. Not probably, I most definitely won't be able to play foot champs. So there might not be any videos or streams this weekend. And on top of that, there might not be good rewards to show to you guys next week. I'm trying to get my brother to play some of my games, but he is not the best at FIFA. Let's just leave it at that. And he probably won't get uh, elite. He might not even get gold. I don't know. My goal is to finish like 10 games before I uh, leave Friday afternoon. And uh, that way, if I can somehow win all 10, it will put him in a better spot to get the other 8 victories of the 30 games that remain. And the reason I'm trying to hit 18 or 20 wins is because uh, so far we've hit like 30 and every single weekend we've hit 34, obviously this one. And I'm confident I can hit 30 again the next weekend. But if we don't hit 20 this weekend, if we don't hit at least 20 this weekend, then we won't make it into the Elite 1 uh, monthly rewards and we won't get the 20 insane red cards from April. And as you know, April had some ridiculous team of the week. So that's why I'm really uh, hoping that my brother can win some of the games. <laughs> and get us to 20 wins but yeah that's what i wanted to share so yeah there probably won't be a lot of videos coming out this week and i'm sorry for that but on the other hand i might actually uh 
do a vlog the first vlog of this channel i might vlog myself in coachella and bring that to you guys but i'm not sure on that yet i'm not sure what the policy is about uh, filming in coachella but if i can do it then i'll definitely bring you a vlog of my three-day weekend in coachella and i hope you guys will enjoy that but yeah that's it for the video today if you guys enjoyed the content so far make sure to hit that like button if you're new to the channel make sure you subscribe but yeah that's it for me go out and smash this weekend league and i'll catch you guys whenever the next video comes out or play out